Speaks Daily. I am your host, Narayan Kar. Today, uh, I will divert uh, from the serious uh, issues on politics to, to sports. I felt it was very necessary to uh, speak on this subject of cricket. As you all remember, the pink ball test match between India and Pakistan was uh, concluded within two days. Even before this test match, the second test played at Chidambaram Stadium in Chennai also was in news for the standard of the pitch which as always England whenever they are defeated groan and moan about. They won the first test match at uh, Chennai but there were no complaints. The pitch was very similar to the second test match pitch which they played at Chennai. But after having won the first test match, there were no complaints from England. But after tasting defeat at the hands of uh, Indian spinners, the complaints started to pour out. So, at the Narendra Modi Stadium at Ahmedabad, the day and night pink test folded within two days and we all saw England complaining about the pitch. But when India goes abroad, say to England, if we have a seeming pitch, the Indians nor the Sri Lankans and other subcontinent nations complained about the seeming tracks from the first session of day one. Therefore, one must understand test cricket is all about the testing. So, one must understand what test cricket is all about. Test cricket is about this testing of the players. Be it the batsmen, how they tackle the ball delivered by bowlers on day one, day two, day three, day four and day five because the wicket or the pitch does not remain the same. As the days goes by, it deteriorates. And that is a challenge in test cricket and therefore it is called test cricket. And the Indian seamers when they travel abroad have learnt the art of swinging and seeming and bowling fast and purchasing wickets and they never complained about the seeming tracks from day one. So this applies also 
to the English bowlers and batsmen and batsmen. They should not be moaning and groaning because they have to come with the mindset of playing in the land of spin. As the Indians have the mindset to play in the land of seeming tracks when they travel abroad. So it will be better for the Englishmen instead of criticizing the pitch and moaning and groaning about it should change their attitude and adapt to the playing conditions. In this particular case, the playing conditions in India is the spinning tracks which they will be offered even in the fourth and final test match at Narendra Modi Stadium at Ahmedabad. I hope the Englishmen understand this, realize this and adopt and adapt themselves to the playing conditions which they will be offered by BCCI and the respective, in this case, Gujarat Cricket Association.